It's the start of a new beginning for Golden Bears football this weekend as spring camp gets underway on the turf at Foot Field. With the start of camp comes expectations from the coaching staff and new head coach Chris Morris. Expectations is that everybody's going to compete. Uh, uh, for us, this camp is about earning roster spots. There's a 85 roster spots around that coming up for the fall, and there's 130 guys coming into camp. So we want we want to see people compete every second they're out on the field, and that's really what we're looking for more than anything else. The difference is really visible, I think, and it starts in the morning runs that we do, starts in the gym, starts in meetings, starts in practice. It's it's really huge, and it's it's present, and you can feel it. It's, you just not it's not just because you're going to these things, but you can feel the atmosphere is getting better. Everybody uh, seems to seems to be a lot more enthusiastic about the season. I remember coming into spring camp last year, and everybody. It's not like nobody wanted to play, but you can just tell on everybody's everybody's faces, everybody. Just the body language of everybody, everybody just wants to get out there and just get better. This new outtake on developing success has created a lot of interest from recruits coming in. There's so many good players coming in, like it really is, it's a plethora of guys, plethora of talent coming in here. We have, you know, I'll start with some of the local guys, you know, we have Ed Elnicki and, you know, Zach Palak and Clinton Richardson, those were the three guys coming from the Spruce Grove program that was in the provincial final this year and one of the most explosive teams probably in, the, in high school football since that Raymond team from a few years ago. You know, we've got some guys coming in from Harry Ailey. We've got Tack Landry from Ailey and Sam Rybiak. Sam Rybiak was one probably in the top two or three offensive linemen in the entire country coming out this year. So some elite level players there. We've got Brandon Moden coming in, you know, Carter Ganton, some guys from St. Albert who we really, really like. Uh, Matt Clark's a tackle coming in from St. Albert who's about 6'6 and about... 260 pounds, the kind of athlete that you just, you know, you know is going to grow into being just a fabulous player. You know, Justin Langcleave's coming in from up from Cold Lake and another tremendous athlete. We, we, the list goes on and on. We have just a just a, a, a large group of very good players coming in and they've bought into what our vision of this program is moving forward. And I think they've seen some of the things, a lot of them waited to sign because they wanted to see what we were doing in the off season and what sort of things, what sort of commitment we were going to make our players give here. It's that high level of commitment that the veterans will look to instill as well, as they also fight for roster spots and look to establish that leadership role. Well, you always ask for leadership from your veteran players, right? And the guys who have been here before and understand, you know, there, there's a certain level of commitment that it takes to be a top-notch CIS player. So we're hoping that those guys, you know, there is a new model and a new way of doing things here as compared to before. So we, we hope that they carry that flag and they see and... What I'm very hopeful of is that they see the benefits that come from this increased structure and the increased accountability and the increased work level and that they carry that flag high and say, look, this is what our standard is. This is what the standard is at U of A now and we, you know, they're going to make sure that other people that come in here you know, uphold that standard. With that new standard and players buying into the concept, it looks like entertaining times ahead for Golden Bears football. I, I, I'm excited. I'm sure everybody else is excited also. And... Uh... With a new program, or I guess a new new systems coming in too, that's a, a big change, and we're all really really excited. And especially with the week uh, already under our belts, it's it's we're gonna do great things. I'm just I'm I'm honestly excited, genuinely excited to get back on the turf, play some football. So, so you're getting to the point where you're feeling that itch where it's oh, you can't wait for the that itch is, seven days from the now. The itch is un been unscratchable. For Golden Bears and Pandas Athletics, I'm Brad Hamilton.